And now, Christophe Kurtz is attempting the longest swim in world history. Take your mark. Go! Hey guys, my name is Christoph Cortez and today we're going to be going over two breaststroke drills, one of which helps your tempo and the other one helps your catch. And I was going to say something else. There's not tempo, it's turnover. We'll talk about that. Guys, just go again. Alright, so the way we're going to be going over these two drills is in serve of progression. Uh, the first drill that we're going to be going over is a breaststroke skull kind of a windshield wiper in front of you with a small freestyle floater thing. What that's going to do is help you feel out your stroke in front of you. And every fourth or fifth skull, you're going to force a pull. Now what this does is it forces you to over exaggerate that pull and forces you to come up out of the water and force forward with zero breaststroke kick behind you. The entire emphasis of the drill is forcing and shooting yourself forward every single time with little to no momentum going into the stroke. Now let me show you what that looks like. The next part of the progression comes in changing that drill into a flutter kick with a continuous pressure pull. So what this drill does is it forces you to catch and pull with very little recovery in between. Hey Ryan, let's show them how it's done. And a little bonus thing that you can do if you still feel like your catch isn't good enough um, to do breaststroke, fist. So you're just doing your normal breaststroke swimming, but you're doing fist just as you would a freestyle fist to completely take the feel out of your hands and add them back when you're doing normal breaststroke. Thanks for watching us. Catch you next time.